Continuing off the idea of the update view, we have this delete view. It's pretty much identical, except we don't need to bring in the form. And then the final thing that we would do is actually have a redirect. So we actually delete the object on that post method and then redirect it somewhere after importing the redirect. And of course my URLs, I update that. And then inside of my templates themselves, the form that's in there, I just rendered out this raw form as we've seen. So we want to do delete the course instead. And the idea here is that we render out this sort of confirm message and then post that message saying, yeah, we confirm. Once you do that post message, then you actually delete that item. So let's go back in and take a look at our courses. I'm going to go into course three, delete, and there we go. So we, do you want to delete the course, another title? We say yes, it deletes, it redirects. Really, really simple, but this is the raw way to do it. There probably is another way to do it, but using the class-based views, this is sort of going off of what we've done, but more importantly, still using that get object method because it is rather important.